Now Griezmann. James Rodriguez. He got nothing but ball. He's conceded the corner. Over it comes. Lewandowski! Great chance with that header, but he sent it wide of the post. Well, it's quite easy to head that one over the bar. This time he just gets his angles wrong, just past the post. William. Chelsea finding forward gears. Can they take advantage of this promising position? Just unable to get his cross beyond the first defender. Wonderful goalkeeping from Manuel Neuer. They won't complain about having won the corner and maybe an opportunity to increase their advantage. Well, not quite. So a throw in to Chelsea. Aidan Azar. Conte, Jorginho, good tackle, front Ribéry, here is Thiago, the, referee the electronic board has been held on off two additional minutes here, now Ribéry has it, let's see what he has in store for them, a poor cross all things considered, and so the first half draws to a close here in West London. Whatever way you slice it, a good night's work for this fellow so far, Lee. Well, Derek, he certainly wasn't. Away they go in the second half, and Bayern are trailing. Here is Thiago. Lewandowski now. Jorginho, and it's a quality pass, now he's got to stay calm, well, visionary passing, and unfortunate with that chip Lee, just over the top. Oh, he's done everything right, he's gone over the keeper, but unfortunately he's gone over the bar as well. James Rodriguez. Slipped through by James Rodriguez. Powerful enough, but not precise enough. No, not accurate enough at all. He had other options. on as well as are Chelsea getting the ball forward what can they do from this position as are doing the maneuvering here and he's fired it against the post James Rodriguez Wow, so, so close to extending the lead. They keep on pushing like this. Surely the pressure will tell. I'm giving the ball to the opposition that time. William. And Conte in the vicinity. And Chelsea have done it. It's going to be so difficult to stop them now. Well, we're going to see the replay here. You can't head the ball in the net if you don't get any crosses in. The crosses are coming in thick and fast, and that was a beauty. That made the goal. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? Substitution for Chelsea. Coming off the pitch. Number five, Jorginho. So, 2 0 now. Number 17, Matteo Cavicci. Goal for Chelsea. James Rodriguez. Bayern have given it away. It's really opening up positively for Chelsea. A 
And the defender finding a solution to the problem. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. James Rodriguez to be replaced by... And that's a deep corner. Time to play it over. And it's Azar's cross. Great chance for Van Hedder, but he sent it wide of the post. Well, it's quite easy to head that one over the bar. This time he just gets his angles wrong, just past the post. Number 22, Sergi Nambu. Fox, really, Azar. Oh, he's lost possession. Fabregas. Pedro. Well, he had a decent reading of that ball in. Well, that's not watertight defending. And a goal! Well, let's see that one again. It's all about the contact. Does everything right. He's not bothered where the goal is. He knows where it is. He gets a beautiful strike on it. Well, a bit more analysis as regards the goal. For Chelsea. There has been a gulf in quality tonight, but you've really got to give them credit for the fact that they haven't let up at all. It's with Robin. And it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes. It's been a thoroughly cogent and convincing performance in this match, Lee. Well, creating goals is hard enough, but the scoring of goals is the hardest thing to do in football. Chelsea, for me, have ticked all the boxes in that department for me. They've been lovely to watch. And look at all the players. They've all got... Fed through by Kovacic. And Kovacic seeing his pass intercepted. Hazard might rely on teamwork. He made it look simple, really. Lewandowski is he going to punish them here well he's thwarted him almost effortlessly Zappa Costa has it this is Pedro Kovacic can they convert fine reaction say from the goalkeeper goalkeeping at its best really really top draw just a couple of minutes left for play. Stamford Bridge, show your appreciation. It's with Robin. Man of the Goretzka. Month. Number seven, Kante. The referee's verdict is three additional minutes. The referee has indicated there will be a minimum. And Chelsea have given us away. Oh, my goodness. What an outrageous hit. I can't believe he took it on from there. And neither can the goalkeeper. Well, we're going to see the replay. The goalkeeper won't want to see this again. He gives the ball away. Still a bit to do, to be fair, but it's his fault. No shortage of goals on this match. 3-1. It's with Mats Hummers. The full-time whistle, and what a fantastic performance by Danny Williams and his teammates. Now, that trip to Bavaria awaits Lee. Well, they deserve all the plaudits. As for Bayern, weren't at their best tonight, but you just sense with the quality in their team, you just feel the second leg will be a lot different. The stars will be there, and we will be too. Coverage of that second leg live.
That was, uh, that was like three months ago. It's still funny. Yeah. What's up? Oh, you know, not a lot. What's, uh, what's up with you? Uh, I'm just coming out of training. I've got a pile of homework to do. Ugh, oh, homework. <laughs> it's the worst. Yeah. Is everything okay? What? Oh, yeah, 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 of course it is. Uh, I was just wondering if uh, you'd heard from that brother of yours lately. Oh, yeah, I, I was in Madrid not long ago, visiting during my March break. March break? Nice, nice. How was that? Um, it was weird. A Alex was weird. He's all big time now. He has, like, an entourage. All these strangers hanging around all the time. I really don't like it. Wow. Entourage. <laughs> Top boy. Living the dream, isn't he? Playing for Real, his own brand. Big star. Can't really blame him, can you? No, I guess not. Are you sure everything's okay? Yeah, 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 obviously it is. I mean, why do you keep asking that? I mean, I'm just checking in with the mate, aren't I? I mean, what's the problem? Uh, no, nothing. I, I just... Actually, I've, uh, I've got to go right now. I've, I've got lots of things to do today, and, and people are, you know, coming and going. It's a, it's a bit of a bother, actually. So, uh, thanks for phoning, and uh, I'll, I'll, I'll check in with you later, you know, talk soon. Okay. Bye. Mi piace, mi piace con lei della flora In altre città d'Europa Tenerla da dietro e sbanfare la Roma Mentre cucina qualcosa di appetitoso bere, bere, bere. Guardare dei documentari È sull'universo e su come funziona wow. È la via di Carlito wow. Ma con un lieto fine wow. Come andare in paradiso wow. Ma senza morire È una rosa senza spine Energie negative Tra i tuoi amici ci sono delle spie Alla faccia di chi lo va a dire mm. uh, Willy Willy uh, Neri Neri Casini Problemi Fammi un applauso con i piedi Ora che sono ancora in piedi Qua non ti ascolta Long range shots When we're away Nothing silences the home supporters Like a stunner from 20 yards out Ora che sono ancora 
We're done. Hit the showers. And the floodlights are shining down on the players here at the home of Bayern, just on the northern outskirts of Munich. I'm Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by Lee Dixon. And Chelsea find themselves in a very advantageous position ahead of the second leg of this Champions League tie. It is Bayern Munich taking on Chelsea. Yeah, thanks, Derek. Bayern with plenty of work to do after that first leg. Not quite good enough, really. They'll need a better performance tonight if they're to progress to the next round. the Bayern side a standard 4-4-2 a formation you know well from your playing days Lee. Yeah I like this formation Derek it's very very important that when they haven't got the ball they all stick together very solid look about it when they don't have the ball very important that they stay close together in midfield the back four will link across the width of the pitch and on the basis of that effort, quite clearly, he's not wearing his shooting boots at the moment. Well, it was a strong effort, used his laces, but uh, screwed it well off target. Understandable that we might want to focus on Robert Lewandowski, given his prowess in front of goal. What do you like about this play, Lee? I just love his position in the box. Every time the ball goes wide or in a crossing area, just watch his position and movement. Gets ahead of defenders, finds space in the box really easily. Top-class centre-forward. He might be able to profit from the wide position. And Willian on the move here. And Willian whips it in. Run of the mill, really, for Neuer. Now Griezmann. Here is Arjen Robin. Lovely ball from Robin. And here's Griezmann. An authoritative challenge. Marcos Alonso. Thiago Lewandowski now Here's man Now Robin This is James Rodriguez Thiago Aidan Azar Given away by Chelsea Chelsea have given us away. Ball lost by Bayern. Now Zappa Costa. Now counter attacking possibilities here. Only setting the table for his team. He'll be delighted to have won the ball having made that difficult challenge. It's a fine piece of attacking play from Lewandowski. Could be up for grabs. Well, Derek, still all square, but how? How's the keeper saved that? Plattered away. Now Ribéry has it. Lewandowski now. And they'll have to throw it back in play. Thiago. This is Robert Lewandowski. He has plenty of support. And it's with Ribéry. Keeper. And Bayern, the recipients of the free kick here. And 
Chelsea into the penalty area. The free kick to Chelsea. On the ball, Zappa Costa. A really sumptuous ball. Danny Williams just has to stay calm. And it is the opening goal of the contest. Well, it was always going to be a tight game, but now all of a sudden, one team ahead. Things have got to change on both sides. And on aggregate here, 4 1 is how it stands. It's with Mats Hummers. This is Robert Lewandowski. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. Aidan Azar with a lovely ball. And Danny Williams is in there. Oh, it's off the post. Stores rear guard action. And the ball, the crossbar, real chance. And that will be that for the first half. Second and decisive leg of this Champions League quarter-final, and the second half begins. Kovacic. Serge Gnabry. This is Robert Lewandowski. Bayern moving the ball around and getting deep into opposition territory. Low-driven ball. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Whatever way you slice it, a good night's work for this fellow so far, Lee. Well, it's nearly all going right. Hit the woodwork, his team's winning, he's scored a goal. What more can he do in this second half? We'll have to wait and see. Yes, man. Well, regaining possession for his side, cleverly. James Rodriguez. Now William, here is Thiago, tremendous intuition to win it back, and now here's Aiden Azar, manoeuvring his way forward, not all that hard to deal with crosses like that. Here is Arjen Robin. Here is Joshua Kimmich. An awful lot of green space to run into. Here's Kovacic. William. This is Alaba. Gnabry. The danger clear. Tiago now, what's he going to do from this position? It's with Robin. Well, a sloppy clearance. What can the opposition do with this? And the keeper making sure that there were no scraps to feed on for the attackers. Can they hit on the break? Conte has lost the ball. And an example of a counter-attack that went nowhere. Kimmich with it. Now Griezmann might profit. Robin at the ready. And it's in from Ian Robin. Well, he's not just a running machine. He's a goal machine as well. What a finish that is. Well, just look at this cross, Derek. It's all about the ball in the box. It's a brilliant effort, and it's a great goal to boot. Goals galore on aggregate. 4-2 is the lead. Rodriguez dispossessed. 
Chelsea happy to pass the ball around and get it forward. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. Well, body in the way. Gnabry with it. Inside the final five minutes now. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Well, we wondered when the moment would arrive. It's about to arrive now. Alex Hunter to come on as a substitute and getting his instructions from the boss. Well, it's about time as well. I think the game needs a change and certainly this young lad can make a difference. Can he do so today? is close well just returning to the story that's been featuring on the back pages of the Spanish newspapers what do you make of the whole situation with Alex Hunter Lee do you think it's perhaps a lack of maturity getting the and a fine pass placed by Alex Hunter Isco has finished successfully little doubt really once he gets in that position Well, you tell youngsters in that position just to hit the target. You can't score unless you do. And on this occasion, he does, and he scores. Well, sadly, we have to conclude that this hasn't really been a contest, but all credit to any side committed to scoring goals like this. Chiellini. Matuidi. They've given it away. Gareth Bale, well that is how to run at defenders, no nonsense clearance, Gareth Bale, and the defender takes care of business, Tony Kroos, delivered into the area here, well thumped clear, so 20 minutes to go, Alex Hunter the tackle crisp and accurate plenty of running room in the wide position Ramos completely on top of the situation running towards goal one man to beat 
And it's gone in! Well, as we see this again, Derek, Bobby Charlton used to say, pass the ball into the net. And that's exactly what he did there. Really lovely finish. There has been a gulf in quality tonight, but you've really got to give them credit for the fact that they haven't let up at all. Now, Matuidi. Janic now. Joao Cancelo. It's with Dybala. This is Kroos. And Hunter, what's he going to do? And Kroos. And in it goes! Well, here's the replay. I'm sure the keeper will be looking at his defenders, but what can they do? It's a lovely strike off his laces in the back of the net. Well, it has been one-sided, but they deserve the plaudits for the fact that they've kept going and going. Well, that is a defender's job to come to the rescue. A good-looking move. In possession, Marcelo. Gareth Bale. Oh, he's through here. Only the keeper to beat. Great chance with that header, but he sent it wide of the post. Well, it's quite easy to head that one over the bar. This time, he just gets his angles wrong, just past the post. Matuidi, Pjanic, Emre Can, Pjanic now, Juventus keep possession and it's positive possession, what can they do from this position? And he has been ruled offside here, can't have been by an awful lot. Oh, I'm not so sure but the linesman's got a better view than I have. Inside the final five minutes now, Alex Hunter. Excellent challenge, Alexandro. Emre Can now. Mandzukic. And here he is, Manj Pjanic. Tremendous block. Crucial block from Varane. Corner for Juve. And over comes the corner. Well, they pulled one back, but perhaps a bit too late in this contest. They haven't been at the races this evening. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. Marcelo. Emre Can now. Matuidi. All over here at the Bernabeu. A productive night for Real Madrid. They take the lead into the second leg and find themselves in a favourable position, Lee. Yeah, absolutely control the game, but more importantly, they control the midfield. Once you control the midfield, you can allow your forwards to go and be creative. I thought Alex Hunter played well. Big character he showed tonight. Bit of a disagreement with his coach, but he went and did the business on the pitch. At Real Madrid, we move the ball with pinpoint accuracy and precisely measured pace. Show me.
Mr. Hunter, your focus and determination today. It is a colossal evening in the UEFA Champions League. The second leg of this quarter-final tie under the floodlights at the very compact Juventus Stadium. Real Madrid prevailing in the first leg. Derek Ray here on the commentary box, joined by Lee Dixon. Yeah, it's hard enough playing Real Madrid on equal terms, but Juve are playing catch-up in this game. Very, very important. They start quickly. Put Real Madrid under pressure. Hunter feeding it through. Tony Kors. Crossing possibilities. And the old lady of Italian football going with this starting 11. Would you call it 4 5 1, Lee? Yeah, I really like this formation, Derek. 4 2 3 1, really. A Juve free kick here. He's been admonished by the referee. He's now got to walk something of a tightrope. Yeah, he knows exactly where he stands. Look at the referee, how he's told him off there. And Ronaldo tries his luck. And the goalkeeper not offering any scraps that time. Pass from Gareth Bale, intercepted. Marco Asensio. Oh, he's knocking on the door. Well, that attempt was never going to trouble the scoreboard operator. Well, you taught as a youngster, technique, technique, technique. He didn't have any there. So the aggregate score now, 6-1 here. Now, Matuidi. Bantagli. Bonucci, Emre Can now. Cristiano Ronaldo. Dybala! He's taken on the shorts, but he's failed to beat the goalkeeper from there, Lee. Well, it was well worth the effort, but uh, well off target. Modric. Bale. My goodness, Lee, the goalkeeper had his work cut out for him, but delivered. Yeah, that's what they do. Look at that save, a brilliant effort. And fired over by Kors. It could be up for grabs. Whatever it takes to keep them out. Quadrado. Emre Can. De Chilio. Dybala. Tony Kors. It's an accurate pass from Kroos. And a fine pass placed by Alex Hunter. Well, the bar can beat the goalkeeper's best friend. Progress has been made by Luka Modric. Marco Asensio waiting to pass. Clearing the lines, and so it will be a corner now. Well, we always think we know exactly what we saw, but on these occasions, the goal decision system comes in handy, Lee. Well, not on this occasion, because it wasn't a goal. We can all see that, but we'll have another look at it. The tighter issues, yes, but sometimes technology gets in the way. That's just a waste of space. <laughs> Carvajal. Luka Modric. Gareth Bale. And the flag has gone up here, offside the decision. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. This is Varane. Gareth Bale. The cross is on. Corner for Real Madrid. He's driven in the corner. And up for grabs off the keeper. And dispossessed. Oh, 
Carlos Costa. Will there be a tangible end product? Paulo Dybala waiting. The tackle completely mistimed, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. And the referee decided that intervention was illegal and cautionable. Oh, without question, it was not the best of challenges. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. He hears the footsteps and feels the pressure. Here's Carvajal. Well, visionary passing. Alex Hunter. Attending to his defensive chores. Dybala. Douglas Costa. Passing like that, part of Luka Modric's game. And positioned at the back post, it's Marco Asensio. The ball with Luka Modric. Marcelo. Moving through the gears. Tony Kors. And three minutes will be added on for stoppages. Here is Marco Asensio. This is Kroos. And Isco. Intelligent threaded pass here. Terrific reflex action. Yeah, you've just got to come out and spread yourself and hope for the best. Corner given to Real Madrid. And a deep ball in. Great save following the... And the goal it is for Real Madrid. They are on a victory course. Well, here's the replay, and the power he's got on the shot here, he knocks the ball off the post. What a finish that is. Now let's go back to the goal that was scored. Now a second goal for them here. Now Matuidi. And with that... Second and decisive leg of this Champions League quarter-final. And the second half begins. So plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here. Hunter! Blocked by Bonucci. We've seen it before. In possession, Marcelo. Marco Asensio. You've certainly got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Lee. Wow, he's simply the difference between these two sides. All the eyes will be on him for this second half. Can he get the hat-trick? Ronaldo! Very straightforward for Keylor Navas. Juventus will have to throw it back in play. Decilio. Matuidi. Is he going to punish them here? And the cross not quite accurate enough. It's with Alex Hunter. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. Juventus have given it away. They're advancing here, Real Madrid. Can they take advantage of the position they're in? And a headed goal it is! Right on cue! Well, here's the replay. Sometimes keepers use those posts as the part of their defence, but not on that occasion. In off the woodwork. Three goals without reply. He was right on top of the situation to get the ball back for his team. Isco. It's with Dybala. 
Quadrado. Sliding it through, Quadrado. Dybala. Can he up a splendid save from the keeper? Danger averted. Yeah, he didn't have long to react to that, but you have to praise his reflexes there. A Juventus corner forthcoming. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. He's driven in the corner. And putting his body on the line. So the corner played into the box. And he's clear his lines. Possibilities for Douglas Costa. Douglas Costa with the cross. And a half-baked clearance. He had the sixth sense to know what to do and win it back. And it's Bernardeschi going for power there, but just too much elevation on the short lead. Yeah, over the bar, Derek, with pace. He's a little unlucky. Second half here, and it's almost Lee a case of whatever they've touched has turned to goals. Well, what's the hardest thing to do on a foot? And a goal here! Accuracy with the header, just what they needed. Well, as the ball comes from, he's not got an awful lot of time or space, but he gets the power from somewhere, and it's a brilliant finish. have another view of that goal a lopsided contest 4-0 10 minutes left for play in this match Bernadeschi that is how to put in a challenge he's been a bit unfortunate in that the ball has gone out Chiellini Federico Bernadeschi and Ronaldo prepared to fire. Hunter. Running with the ball confidently. Running towards goal. One man to beat. And in it goes. The perfect header. Exactly what they were looking for. Let's have a look at that again. The keeper thinks he's done enough, but he hasn't. It's just gone past him. He does get a touch on it, though. Well, let's go back to the goal that was scored. Oh, my goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. Bonucci. Just a couple of minutes left for play. Bernardeschi. And now Ronaldo. It's going to be a free kick for Juventus. He's now got to be extra careful. A verbal warning rather than a caution here. Yeah, the next one, he knows where he's going. In the book. You never really know, Lee, if it's going to come off when you hit it on the volley in that fashion. Yeah, hero to zero. When he struck that, you think, wow, and then all of a sudden you realise where it's gone. And Matuidi in the right place to get it back. Considerable momentum, courtesy of Ronaldo. But what can he produce from here? For the third year running, Real Madrid are the victors of the Champions League against Juventus and the Merengues will go through to the semi-final. Literally just too strong for them. Real Madrid have quality right throughout the team from 1 to 11. Everywhere you look, there's quality players. There's maybe an obvious answer. Marco Asensio. Oh, he's knocking on the door. Well, that attempt...
I expect all of you to put in intelligent challenges when needed. Today we work on our tackling and nothing else. A good session, I appreciate it.
Crossing. It's basic, but it's the most reliable way to create chances. Let's get to work. Good day of training all around, but Hunter, you eat something different this morning? Hi there once again, Martin Tyler here along with Alan Smith. I hope you're enjoying our coverage of the Women's World Cup here in France and we're just minutes away from the start of the quarter-final between the USA and Australia. Yep, getting towards the sharp end of this competition and the Americans seem to be getting stronger with each passing round and gaining in belief that they can go on and claim that record-breaking fourth title. This is the team picked by Australia for this game. Well, we've gone with a 4-3-3 formation here for them. Is that the way you see it, Alan? Yeah, I mean, it can. In with a chance! It's a top effort, really, but it's just too high. Maybe next time that kind of effort will be on target. Hunter. Trying to unlock the defence with that through ball, Kim Hunter. Real opening now! Hunter! It's a fast start here. They deserve that goal. They'd be the better team early on. Well, you get a lot of satisfaction as a goal scoring forward for knocking one in from that distance. You know you're in the right place. No, it was a poacher's effort. The final finish wasn't difficult, but to get there that took a little bit of instinct. And that has opened the scoring. 1 0 here. Now Catley. Now a chance to get a bit of width into this attack. It's offside, and the referee's given it. Oh. 
Tremendous development in the women's game. Such an entertaining watch, I have to say. The last decade or so, everything's improved. Remember Vancouver, that final in 2015, over 53,000 attended. And you can see from our viewing figures and the attendance here in France, it's only getting bigger still. Yeah, it is growing all the time. And there's been so much investment into the youth squads, getting younger girls to play the game from an earlier age. And that can only help in their development, and their skills. And it's a great thing to see. We've given it straight to the opposition. Hunter. Now Kerr. Now Rasa. Catley. Gori. Really getting at the opposition this far up the pitch now. Did well, stuck out a foot and cut off the pass. Carpenter. Helen Knight. To Kerr. Starting infield now. And that's a turnover to the opposition. Gori. Now Kerr. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. It's Ford. To Alloway. Carpenter. Van Egmont, Kerr, and shoots! Shot blocked here. Couldn't keep it in play, it's gone out for a throw. It's with Lloyd here, supporting player alongside. Hunter. Here's the shot from really connected well and disappointed to see that fly off target. Yeah, somebody in the crowd more in danger from that shot. That's a good spot by the defender. Here's Polkinghorne. Lovely, incisive pass. Taking on the defenders. Now, here is a jump. Got to be. And the kind of save you make after training every day for that kind of situation from close range. And in it goes. Morgan! Two in front now. Well, keep the concentration, and they've won this match, I think. That goal really takes your breath away. Well, it's not a coincidence. They've scored plenty of times from these kind of corner kick situations. Restarting at 2-0. Two, two, well, two more minutes to play, that of added time. Rasso. High class first half performance in the quarter final of this cup competition. And we're back underway in this quarter final between the USA and Australia. Threads it through. One of the most spectacular goals you'll see. Top corner, top class. It's not often you can say it, but that was truly unstoppable. That's her second goal, and no wonder she's happy. One team really on their game today, the other very off-colour. Ellie Carpenter. And they're looking good when they get the ball out wide, as they've done here. Free kick here.
presented possession to the opposition now. Here's a chance to go down the outside of the opposition. Can really get at the opposition here. Oh, very easy for the goalkeeper there. Comes in with a tackle. Now Kerr. Maybe just missed, kicked it a little bit there and pass goes straight to the opposition. Trying to get involved, I think, the forward by coming this deep to get on the ball. Neatly intercepted. To Kerr. Gori. Here's Kelland Knight. This is an exercise in patience as they try to get an opening. Heath. Lloyd. On the move and able to cut out the pass. United States on the attack. The cross aimed for Kim Hunter. Far too close. The cross to the keeper. Ellie Carpenter. Here's Gori. Here's Kellen Knight. A bit predictable with the passing and the opposition able to deal with that. Morgan. Opportunity now. Back into play off the crossbar. Surely. Goodness me, it's hit the post. That was a puff out your cheeks moment and phew, got away with it. Now Alloway. Pressed high here. Just over a quarter of an hour left on my watch. Now Kerr. Van Egmont. Helen Knight. Here's Gori. Here's Kelland Knight. To Ford. Tackle goes in. Megan Rapino. That'll be a throw in to Australia. Here's Kelland Knight. It's Ford. Carpenter. Some options now for the pass. Trying to thread a pass through, but not successful. The shot's on! You're going to get a corner here because of that deflection. Corner swung in. Now, we've only got four minutes... Remaining in the match. Well, they had the runner going through and the pass wasn't quite right, was it? It was too strong. The four players has indicated face another two minutes two. added on by the referee. Excellent. Helen Knight. Here's Butt. It's looking good, this move. It's another step towards the trophy, they hope. They are into the semi-final. Well played, USA. Well, they've looked so strong throughout this tournament. And they did have there today, even when they faced a challenge as big as this one. They always seem to find a way. They always step up to the mark. Don't forget that semi-final, which is coming up in a few days. You can watch all the action live on EA.
Clean contact, precise passes. We move the ball like we can, and we'll own possession for 90 minutes. Show me. A very good session today, but it needs to be said. Well, she thinks I should go pro. I mean, an agent like her, I should probably take her advice, right? And not go to college. Don't know about that. But you said the game's exploding. Opportunities, the going pro is a real option. I said it makes you think, not that you should do it. Well, she said I'm a real game changer. She said that? Yeah, but I mean, you know, agents, you're the best, you're the greatest, where's my 20%, right? Hunter, tell me I did not just hear that. You've been speaking to an agent? Do you know the team rules about discussing contracts while on international duty? Yes, we were just talking. Get outside, now! I'm sorry. My brother came to visit me and he, he brought his agent with him and she just started talking. It, it wasn't planned. It, I thought she was just being friendly. But it won't happen again, I promise. Being here, being part of this team, it means everything to me. All right. This is your final warning, Hunter.